Hey everyone, my name is Evan. I'm a senior sales engineer here at Supermetrics. Today I'm going to show you how to set up transfers between your marketing data and Google Cloud Storage. Let's get started. The first thing you'll want to do is to sign into the Supermetrics team site with your Google or Microsoft account. The team site is where you can manage all things Supermetrics, including licenses, billing, and data transfers. For now, let's jump over to the Integrations tab and find Destinations. This is where we'll configure the destination, which we'll be sending the data to. In this demo, I'm going to be showing Google Cloud Storage, so I'm going to click on Create New and then choose Google Cloud Storage from the dropdown. Once I've chosen the destination, I'll fill in this information. When I'm done, I can test the configuration and then save it. Now, depending on your business and partitioning strategy, you may want to move your data to multiple different locations. Once you're done configuring your first destination, you can create another one following the same steps. Now that we have the destination configured, we can create a new transfer under the Transfers tab. I'm going to click on Create New and then select Facebook Ads as my data source and click OK. From here, you'll see an unnamed new transfer and you'll want to choose the destination we just configured. This is also where you'll set your transfer schedule. Choose the schema you want to use and select the account from which you want to pull data. By the way, if you want to control the volume of data you're transferring, or you need specific metrics or dimensions that aren't available in the standard schema, you can navigate over to the Query Manager and create a custom schema. When you're happy with all the settings, click Save. This will automatically start the transfer. When you're done setting up a new transfer, you'll see it under the Transfers tab. From there, you can easily create a backfill to get your historical data flowing into your Google Cloud Storage bucket. Once your transfers are ready, you can see all of the data you just moved represented as individual files in your Google Cloud Storage bucket. And that's it. That's how easy it is to get your data moving into Google Cloud Storage. If you want to try this today with your own data, feel free to start your own 14-day free trial. Again, my name's Evan. Thanks for joining me today.